we have a reading of the color Bible or well, the New Testament of the King James Version of the of the Bible. This is from the, the Gullah people, the Gullah culture. My my on my maternal side, uh, my great grandfather was, was Gullah. Um, well, his wife was Mohawk Indian, but um, so I had this idea, not this idea. Uh, uh, well, yeah, this idea. Uh, I want to somehow feel, somehow connect, you know, with with my Geechee, you know, my Gullah Geechee roots, right? So, um, you know, from South Carolina. Do 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 do. do. Anyway. So, um, so I, I decided to attempt to start reading out of the Gullah Bible aloud, because, right? you know, you can read in your head when you're basically talking, you know, to your, to the God in yourself, whatever it is. But when you have to struggle, you know, get a little fiction, you know, you got to do how you say it, um, uh, what do you say, it? Uh, a little difficulty when you make errors. Nobody wants to make a mistake. Oh my goodness. And you try to read this, make mistake, you know, because it's it's the, it's 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 a translation of the King James version. So the, it looks like, so you see, so here's the way it looks. Like this is the the the, the Gullah Geechee, right? And this is the, um, you know, the Marlowe language. You know, the King James version, the Marlowe language, the Shakespeare kind of kind of language here, but it's in smaller smaller things. I don't happen to have my uh, my reading glasses, but they're in, well, they're in South Africa. Um, uh, but I'm at my, I'm at my brother's house. He's a big time professor, right? And so he, uh, uh, you know, he got a lot of books. He's older now. He's retired, you know, so but he's got to read because, you know, that's what they, they've been doing all their life. That's hence all the books. This is not a quarter of the books, you know, whatever. This is not even an eighth of the books this boy got. Anyway, so, so he uses this. So now I can use this while I'm here. So I'm going to do that. So, uh, what, what should we do? Okay. Okay. So here's how we do this. Uh, Gotta start my ritual, my morning ritual about this. Okay, we back up a little bit, just like that. No, claw up. Uh, this is kente cloth from, uh, I think it's from Ghana. There's all kinds of kente cloth, uh, but this is a rare one that nobody has. Okay, so I just do like this. Hold my heart, my head, I'm out. Put it on. Now I'm official. Oh, this is the, uh, this is my uh, Ogun cap. I'm going to see in uh, how do you say this in the Yoruba culture, right? From from Nigeria, Ogun's color is like blue, and then it went to Brazil, and I think it's blue and white, or vice versa. I don't, you know. But when it came when it came to North America through the Cuban strain, then the, the colors for some reason became um, uh, black. It's the only other in the inside is black, green, right, and a little bit of red. So that's why I wear this cap, you know, like that. <laughs> okay, um, so I'm, I'm, I'm in my Ogun state, okay? Uh, but here's what we do every morning, or at least six mornings a week. We don't really do it on Sundays. We have a Sunday sermon. We use our, um, we use our Sunday sermons, of our, our, how do you say it, our scriptures from Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. and his uh, compensatory concept code book. Um, so that's the only day we do We don't do it. So we just turn to any page. Boom, like that. Hey, John, uh, let's go to page uh, 381. Right? Uh, uh, well, I liked, I don't want to do 21. I'll do 22. I don't say I don't like 21, but I'll do 22. So what we usually do is we read uh, the Gullah first. Cause that, that, that. Then we read the translation, then we go back to the Gullah, then we read the translation. That's how we do something like that. So here we go. Uh, John, John 17. Uh, 22. I done ye glory, same like your ye glory to me, so that they all can have one hat, one heart, uh, like we have one heart. Okay. I think I almost, so now I gotta, I gotta use this because I don't have my, my reading glasses. And it translates, uh, and the glory which thou gavest me, I have given them, that they may be one, even as we are one. Oh, that's a good sentiment, right? Okay. So again, let's read it again. I done ye glory, same like ye get glory to me, so that they all can have one heart, 
like we have one heart. Again, uh, and and the glory which thou hast given me, I give them. I give them, them that they may be one, even as we are one. Well, there you go. So, like I said, I'm trying to learn about I'm trying to get a porthole, port up, trying to get a grip into uh, my my culture, and that's that's the way I do it. I being me, T from the Patterson Stick, the train to bed, letting you know what I only suspect.